Hello everyone, I'm Madonna and I'm going to show you how to make some really simple earrings. So what you're going to need is, you're going to need some head pins, a couple of about five millimeter jump rings, you're going to need round nose pliers, and regular pliers for this and cutters. And so what you're gonna do, I'll show you a couple that I made ahead of time. And that's these off of the fairy strands. And basically what this is, is the flower. And then one of these spacer bars And then a little tulip, another little bead out of the strand, and then your another little tulip. And then you put your wire on it. This is the other one, not quite as big. And that's pretty simple to make. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my head pin and I'm going to place upside down I'm going to place that flower on upside down and then I'm going to add this little jewel that was in the strand for glitter effect. And then I'm going to add one of the little flowers, give it a little bit of color, and then another smaller flower. And then what I'm going to do is take my round nose pliers and I'm going to put it onto just about there. Then I'm going to take my regular pliers. Some people do this by hand, others do it with pliers. I find it easier to do with pliers. So, you go down and go around maybe one and a half times. And that's what it looks like. And then you're going to cut as close as you can to that. And then you're going to hold your, your loop with your round nose pliers. You're going to stick it in sideways. You're not going to be putting it on either of them. You're going to be putting it in between just to hold it straight while you fix your piece that you cut. You want to bring it in. so that it's not in the way. Then you want to straighten your loop a little and it's going to look like this. And then you're going to take your jump ring. I've got about a five millimeter here and you're going to just hook it in here then you're going to hook an ear wire on it. And close it. And there is your earring. You can put as many of these on as you want, as few. It's entirely up to you. I'll show you how to do one more the flower, 
upside down. The crystal ball. the little flower piece, and then the little tulip. And you've got those on there. And you're just going to repeat. If you have strong fingers and you can do it, then maybe moving your wire with your fingers is the best, but I've always found that pliers work the best for me because I get a tighter grip on it. Cut again. As you bring this around, you're just going to Put your plier on it and pull it around. You're not going to do any major movement there with it. Now that I have that, I'm going to my jump ring. my earring piece they are pretty simple to do and like I say you can do them a lot of different ways like these have been done there's that one and this one And then we have this one. Get them to quit wobbling so you can see them better. But they are really cute to wear and they are simple to make. So until my next video, I will see you.